Things happen in training. Hey guys, it's day 333 of 366. I'm reading the Daily Stoic by Ryan Holiday and giving you my two cents. So, April 26th, things happen in training. When your sparring partner scratches or headbutts you, you don't then make a show of it or protest or view him with suspicion or as plotting against you. And yet you keep an eye on him, not as an enemy or with suspicion, but with a healthy avoidance. You should act this way with all things in life. We should give a pass to many things with our fellow trainees. For, as I've said, it's possible to avoid without suspicion or hate. That's from Marcus Aurelius in Meditations. By seeing each day and each situation as a kind of training exercise, the stakes suddenly become a lot lower. The way you interpret your own mistakes and the mistakes of others is suddenly a lot more generous. It's certainly a, a, certainly a more resilient attitude than going around acting like the stakes of every encounter put the championship on the line. When you catch an elbow or an unfair blow today, shake off the pain and remind yourself, I'm learning. My sparring partner is learning too. This is a practice for both of us, that's all. I know a bit more about him or her, and from my reaction, you're going to learn a little bit more about me too. Things happen in training. Not everything's going to go the way you want. Um, and do try. Maybe you should go easy on yourself sometimes, but do try. Put a good effort into doing our duty as Stoics being good have the right intentions doesn't mean you're going to get everything right doesn't mean the people you surround yourself with are always going to get things right so uh, cut yourself some slack and uh try and enjoy a little bit all right see you tomorrow